Hello and welcome to Lloyd BMW South Lakes. Today we've got this fantastic long wheelbase 7 series, it's the 745LE X-Drive M Sport finished in black sapphire metallic paint and inside we have black Nappa leather interior. This particular car was registered in October 2020 and has covered a shade over 11,000 miles. Spec wise we've got the premium pack, we've got the rear seat comfort pack, we've got the technology pack, we've got the sun protection glass you can see there on the rear of the car, we've got these gorgeous 20 inch diamond cut alloy wheels and you've got the two charging cables for the hybrid system. So it's obviously got the battery for the hybrid system and it's also got a three litre straight six petrol turbo engine in the uh, front there driving all four wheels. Uh, anyway, that's the outside. Let's have a look on the inside. So on the inside, we've got the black Nappa leather with the exclusive stitching. Uh, you've got the comfort seat, so you've got sort of less bouldering, which makes them more uh, comfortable. You've got the electric seats down there and the seats themselves have got two position memory along with the uh, massage function as well. You've got electric windows all around, you've got electric folding mirrors, you've got the upgraded Harman Kardon sound system, you've got electric boot lid as well. Jumping inside the car, you've got the digital dashboard there in front of you, where you can see the mileage is 11,033 miles. Uh, right, what else have we got? So, to start the car, foot on the brake, press the start button, car comes to, uh, comes to life. As you'd expect, satellite navigation is standard on the car and I can use that just to show you where we're located. So we're based up in Cumbria in the Lake District. We're about 10 minutes off junction 36 of the M6, just to the south of Windermere. Beautiful part of the world. If you're ever passing, feel free to, uh, to call in. Selecting reverse gear, you'll see that we've got the camera out the back, but we also have cameras all the way around the car as well. So we can have a look down that side and we can have a look down that side as well. And when I put it into parking, you can also see how far your doors open as well. So you don't bang into anything. Uh, right, what else have we got in here? So, um, we've got Bluetooth, we've got DAB radio on there as well. You've got uh, a CD player down here, you've got your dual zone climate control, so you pass and you can have a separate temperature to the driver, or you can have them both to uh, both together. Seats, you've got heated seats here, you've also got ventilated seats on this button as well. Uh, so whether you're hot or you're, uh, you're cold, you can have that. This little button here is to do with the fragrances. So the fragrances are stored in this box here and you get a choice of two fragrances as well. So you can get a choice of, uh, of fragrance coming through the, into, into the cabin there. Uh, beneath here, we have a wireless charging tray. So you've got a wireless charging phone, just stick it on there. If you haven't, you can plug it in. A couple of drinks holders there as well. Automatic gearbox for your different driving modes. You've got your different uh, battery modes. Parking sensors come on automatically, but you can turn them on and off manually. You've got your camera mode, you've got air suspension, so you can raise or lower your um, suspension using this button. Electric handbrake there. Steering wheel wise, you've got the multifunction steering wheel, so you've got your cruise control and everything on this side. You've got your audio controls on this side. You've got heated steering wheel as well. Uh, if you wanted to, you could change gears manually using the paddles. You've got automatic wipers, automatic headlights. We've got head up display, which is sometimes difficult in bright sunlight, but hopefully I'll have a go. Uh, so hopefully you can see to the left is 10 miles an hour, which is the speed limit on site, and to the right is our actual speed, which obviously is zero. When we go to change radio stations and satellite navigation instructions, they come up on this head up display as well. So uh, just keeps things a little bit safer. Car's also got this big glass sunroof. Uh, which is obviously fully electric and this little button here we can then tilt it and then we can just slide it back with this button and then that opens up like so then to close it just press it forwards right what else we got let's have a look in the back because i suspect that's where uh, most people would like to be um so obviously being the long wheelbase you can just see how big that door is uh, it's a huge door, actually whilst I'm closing the front door, point of interest, it's got the soft closed door feature so you don't need to slam it, just pull it to and then the electric motors take control. So you've got this huge door um, which then opens up and gives really easy access into the back. Uh, there is three seats across the back, obviously the two outer seats are a little bit more comfortable. Um, and they've got the little pillows there on the headrest and then this center section can fold down and then you've got all your electric controls for your seat on here uh, the outer seats are also heated and obviously you've got your own air conditioning in the rear as well uh, and then the other one which i really like on the 
on this is the uh, little vanity mirrors here. So uh, you just pull down, you've got the little, little vanity mirror mirrors there, and you can see just acres and acres of uh, space, um, you know, in front of you. It is a really luxurious and comfortable car, and obviously the Harman Kardon sound systems in the back, and obviously you've got your electric memories and stuff in the back as well as your massaging. Right, let's close that down. Coming around the back of the car, 745LE, X-Drive, electric boot, so we can just press the button there. That opens up. Being the hybrid, it's a slightly smaller boot than, say, a petrol or a diesel version because you've got the hybrid batteries, so it's a little bit shallower. You've got the two charging cables over here, but you'd also do have additional storage space underneath the boot floor and over here as well. So uh, I'm sure that's still plenty of room for uh, for most people. And there we have it. So if you're in the market for a BMW 7 Series plug-in hybrid, then uh, this one is fantastic. Uh, currently for sale here at Lloyd BMW South Lakes. If you've got any interest in it, just give us a shout. We're always happy to answer any of your questions, work out finance figures for you, organise a test drive for you. Or if you're not local to us, don't worry, we also offer a nationwide delivery service as well. In the meantime, I do hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.